morning, good morning, y'all. I made it to my stop. See? Hope I turn off my light. There we go. I'm at Tate and Lyle's place. That's right, delivering this good old alcohol to Tate and Lyle. <laughs> Not Andrew Tate, but Tate and Lyle. And uh, follow the guy to my spot to unload and I unload myself. So just meet you on the other side of this clip. Good morning! Hey again. I'm waiting for him to look over to see of A and stuff. So I got my fresh mojo one. Take me my morning sip, you know. Mmm. Oh. Coffee's so good. And it's so stuffy because it's gonna rain and I can feel the humidity. Because I am a human barometric pressure, whatever. Barometer, human barometer. When it's ready to rain, I sweat it out. And it just, it rains off my head. Mm. Uh, I hope you're enjoying your coffee. So with that, it's just a wait. Tick, 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 tick. Boom! Now I'm over in the control room waiting for the old lab lab. I had to move forward about 50 feet. See, that's what you were seeing earlier, but there's a building, you know, behind me. So, just chilling at Tate and Lyles. Chilling at Tate and Lyles. Trying to give them their moonshine. They make ingredients and stuff for, oh, Nutri-Grain Valley Bars, uh, QP Mayo stuff from the China stuff. They make that stuff, I think, here. They make the precursors or the ingredients for it. And uh, Skittles, and we know how bad Skittles are. Hey, I'm at a chemical factory and there's Skittles. Makes you start to think. No. All right. Well, I'm waiting on this. That was a young kid, but then he was married and had five kids. And I look at him like, dude, you're like five foot five and 120 pounds. You look like a kid. And then I, I realized, shit, I'm the one getting older. See how that works? And then your parents call you, and you're in your 40s, and you're getting called a kid by people in their 70s. But then you're calling kids that are 20s and 30s. I guess we're all a kid. We never grow up, really. I know I don't. There's no fun in growing up. You know what I mean? My, my whole existence has lasted longer than this body form, so I gotta have a really good sense of humor. So I maybe, I don't know. So, with that, I see someone move by the window after they're coming outside. I'm like, Whoop. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh, he said, I wouldn't hurt to get a sample. Alrighty. I got a selfie radio for you. Everybody hey, I'm gonna prank call people. Awesome. And then, sign my, my children's future away, I guess. Driver has read and understands soap and PP rules. Soap and PP? Oh, SOP and PPE, okay. You know, never know what Leighton Tile's up to, Tate and Lyle's up to. Leighton Tile, doing a dyslexic. Is it the ninth or tenth? I forgot. Ah, it don't matter. Anything I gotta do on this first page? Oh, the first page. Oh, that's for you. That's your homework, man. You're getting your homework back. That's more than I have to do. I got my hard hat, glasses, goggles, face shields, uh, jet pack, uh, acid suit. I mean, I got it all. I gotta see that jet pack. No, I wish. <laughs> you see, I'm going to break. <laughs> well, what the hell, man? They never come back. People are calling me an alien. What's that up in the air? All righty, I guess uh, I'll go back there and I'll find my tank, I suppose. Are you going to meet me back there? Yeah, all right, there, yeah. all right. Yeah. I got pictures of the tank on my phone. We got an app we can look up and shit. So I got pictures where I load. I just got to look on my phone. It's called Driver Recon. Our company's nice sometimes. All uh, right, I'm here. All right, hey. All right, Ray. All right. All right. All right. Oh, goofball. All right, look, hey, you got a reading now? Yeah. One point, two, three inch cut off. All right, you ready to start your bump? Oh, they're brewing something up, as you can tell. Five mile an hour. Well, there ain't really much other there. Yeah. Alright, go ahead and we'll make the changes. Pump on, jump up. Alright, it's all yours. Hey, this valve down here, Ray, does it need to be partially open? Oh, well. Yeah, they parked it close to it, so I control the flow. Alright, it's wide open. But, hey, I've got about 30... Bouncing 29 to 32 GPH. Yeah, I'm trying to out 28 here. Now 29, head toward 30. Gallons uh, per hour. GPH. You guys want to know? Who perfect out? Hey, this is where I'm loading. I'm loading. Yeah, that's it. Right 
Doo-doo-doo. Gotta follow him. See, he got five kids. He looks like he's like 20 years old. His five kids been eating him. Eating all the food that he's supposed to eat. There we go. We got her. Now time to get to work and get this sample up. Whew. Not unloading yet. Just waiting still. A bunch of bull And uh you have six hours of Yeah. It's uh 7.30, quarter to eight, and the your clamp cable that goes and grounds my trailer because I got alcohol. It's not working on the end. There's a little LED light on a little clamp, look like jumper cables on one end. One side has a light. So when you make a connection, a ground. The green light's supposed to turn on, let you know there's a ground. Now there's a turning on, it takes like a little square battery, right? Like, you know, the ones you stick, stick your tongue on. Well, so they went and got a second one. Well, that light ain't working. So I'm figuring out, like, what the hell? Why aren't these lights working? Maybe you got some shit. Maybe you got some shit cables. That's what I'm thinking. So right now, I'm just sipping on your old mojo. I hooked up and uh, waiting to start up my truck and pump so I can unload. Twiddle dee, twiddle dumb, twiddle the thumb. I just wanted to keep you an update on the craziness I deal with sometimes. We all deal with craziness at our job site. Some just deal with different types. I'm just showing you the types. <laughs> all right. Doo -doo -doo. Just wanted to come back before I, you know, you know, blah, 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 I'm back again. But I want to make a complaint on uh, Duracell batteries. See that? See, see the, it uh, leaked. And those aren't even that old. Those triple A's I probably bought like three months ago. And they leaked in my uh, DOT pass. This deal, that deal. So, yeah. What's up, Duracell? Do I need to switch to the old Rayovac? I ain't going Energizer. Energizer, I've had them batteries explode too. They just suck. Just wanted to show you that Duracell ain't always up to, not the cup top. I don't know. And just, you never know what you get with batteries. Sometimes you get good long-lasting batteries, sometimes you get robbed and cheap. Maybe it's like buying a car. You want to make sure you buy batteries that are made on a certain date. <laughs> and they make them big old bridge girders and beams and stuff over that. This factory. Right there. I used to put those up and make the connections. And all them studs on the tops of the beams. I just have to use a stud gun and shoot those all in the beams. Maybe I'll go back to that work. Not. Oh, hell no. This ass ain't welding no more and this ass ain't working construction. Not a never. I'm done with it. I did my fair share and fair time. Of truck driving and construction. It's after this. Driving, it's easy street from here on out. I'll go work at freaking the grocery store and I'll go. And I've been wanting to think maybe I'd go into meat, you know. Go to school and become a meat cutter. I don't know. Maybe I'll get a discount on steaks. Done unloading, I just got a text message. Hey, I need you to come back all the way to the terminal. So I said going to Kansas City and Kansas, you know, I gotta go to Omaha now. So I had three hours of that. Man, that's alright. Alright. Is what it is, but I hate when they change plans all on you at the last second. And, uh, to try to make it, I got 480 miles to go. So, let's have fun. Come on now. Let's get out of here. All right. At least I'm empty. It's a lot faster now, going up the hills and the Ozarks. Instead of chugging, chugging like a tractor, five mile an hour. Ooh, that's a pothole. Ooh, that's another pothole. Straight on the camera, right? There we go. Alright. Ain't no one coming, so let's go, go, go!
it's uh, 6 p.m. I ain't posting this tonight. I'll do some editing. That's uh, that's it. I'll do, finish editing tomorrow. Uh, I already got my day planned out all the way till I got home. So I got preload trailer tomorrow. Bungy down the road at Soybean Place. Soybean all up. And I'll uh, take it back to the yard here where I'm at. And right out here in the yard, I'll go drop it and pick up the preloaded trailer. And then take it to Kansas City. Three, three and a half hours down the road. Unload it. Gotta get there before 4 p.m. Easy peasy, butter greasy. Shoot, I'm gonna be there by noon. And then I gotta bring that empty, dirty trailer to the Pleasant Valley Tank Wash that I've brought you to several times. Pick up another preloaded trailer and deliver that Friday morning in Springfield. And probably take the dirty trailer to Joplin and go back home and enjoy the weekend, right? I got a long weekend because I got a dentist Friday. Yay, I got a crown to do back on this tooth. Oh, uh, new tooth again? Hell yeah, until I get all of them back in. <laughs> That's very expensive, but is it worth it? I don't know. Yeah, money's money. It comes and goes. It's just paper. It has no value. Life has value and enjoying life does. <laughs> so I got a bunch of gardening to do this weekend. Gonna be planting tomatoes. It's gonna rain three, four days out of the week next week, so it is planting time because it's gonna get watered by the good old Lord next week. My mom likes that because she wants to stand out there freaking <laughs> but I call it like therapy when I go out there and do it. But uh I love to reap the rewards and uh when grandma and sissy and I makes getty sauce and but it's mostly grandma because she'll simmer tomatoes down all day long, big pots of them. And all through the year, we don't buy spaghetti sauce or chili sauce. We use our own, we grow our own, and that's the way to be. That's mm -mm. Even when we're making pizza sauce. We'll take the tomatoes and cook it down even more and make a good pizza sauce. And uh, now we're going to grow a bunch of other vegetables and make the garden a little bigger, as you've seen. And uh, with that, just remember, this fat, crazy truck driver always loves you. And Jesus Christ always loves you. Whether you believe in it or not, he always believes in you until the day you die. You know what I'm saying? Heck. And uh, with that, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, well, this video will be posted tomorrow evening, but I won't post one Friday, I'll post that Sunday. You know, the, the normal stuff. With that, I'll be the Zane and Child Choose. Get out of here and enjoy your rest of your day.